This is sample number 10 called Ball Burn and John Hutchison says it is a metal vaporization effect and it is from 1986. It is in stainless steel and we have a magnet here, neodymium magnet here and if we can confirm that just with no traction there. So, uh, we're going to measure the weight. Uh, this is an extreme close-up of the effect that has occurred to this sample. And you can see that uh, there are some Spherical pieces removed uh, around the top, and one suggestion is is that there is some energy build up inside, and when the power is turned off, this it gets to the interface between the air and the metal, and these kind of effects occur and it looks like the ball is like half sitting inside and half sitting outside of the sample. And you can see the cavities on the top here again. Globular almost imagine the balls or whatever they are dancing around moving from one place to another and eating out these sections of the stainless steel this sample was taken from a large bar uh, that vaporized uh, George Hathaway who worked with John Hutchison for some time uh, said that this comes from the same setup as the electric spacecraft lab, the electric spacecraft setup. John says that a lot of the samples um, were never seen in their actual transformation by him because he was uh, busy running the machinery that were witnessed by others.